neuroscientists today are basically materialists. Therefore, the mind isn't doing anything, and it's very difficult to understand why it should be there at all. And, uh, but um, why are they materialists? There's a, a tremendous inertia from the philosophers of the past. And the philosophers of the past were in a situation where the world was understood to be a classical world, which was deterministic, in which the mind had no role. But that physical theory no longer is true. It's known to be untrue. And the new physics, quantum mechanics I'm talking about, uh, has an actual role for, for consciousness to play. That the laws of quantum mechanics are not formulatable, and you cannot get no uh, predictions out of the theory unless you allow what Bohr calls the choice on the part of the experimenter. In, in, in classical mechanics, you start at a deterministic uh, understanding of what happens at the lowest level, and this determinism just builds up. Now, in quantum mechanics, you start at the lowest level, and already there's this uncertainty, this potentiality. And of course, um, the way it builds up in any nonlinear system, you have a little bit of variations at the lowest level, and it, it, it explodes. Uh, so, so, so you look at the whole brain as, as a single quantum mechanical absolutely. system. Absolutely. That's the point. The whole brain can have patterns of neurological activity, and it... Can, the, can this whole table have, have quantum mechanical uh, patterns of, of activity? Well, of course. Every system has, has patterns of activity. But the question is, the, the core reality upon which quantum mechanics is based are these actual occasions. And these actual occasions, or actual events, are things that have two aspects, which quantum mechanics describes. The one aspect is a collapse of the wave function, something action in the physical world. But it's associated with a psychological element, such that there's a close connection between the psychological element and the pattern of neurological activity. In the quantum mechanical understanding of what's going on, you have this template for action, I call it. That's the pattern of neurological activity that's sending out all these okay. nerve impulses just the right way. And it's associated with a conscious intention. In other words, there's an intent, uh, in, your, in your mind, there's an intent. And this, this actual occasion has two aspects. It has the psychological aspect and the physical aspect, which are linked together. The point is, if you look at it quantum mechanically, not classically, the, the laws of evolution of the in the physical realm only determine potentialities for something to happen. They do not answer this question of what question is going to be asked. You need something else outside the physical, outside the known laws to determine what the question will be. So what you're saying is that consciousness at least in human beings, is outside the, the physical laws of our brain and therefore intervenes and makes the, the choices within the quantum mechanical systems of our brain. And so you really have two things happening in parallel. Right. And in order to make the quantum mechanics work, you need another process, which is what, is, what question is going to be asked? And you look at the quantum mechanical laws, they do not determine what question is going to be asked. They determine, once you ask the question, how it's going to evolve. In actual practice, these choices are determined by psychological process. So you have a, a need for a psychological process to, to make the quantum mechanics work. And Bohr often had a famous quote, never forget that in the uh, drama of human existence, we ourselves are both actors and spectators. In the classical worldview, they were just spectators. All they did was watch what was happening, but couldn't do anything. In quantum mechanics, you need them as actors. If the neuroscientists would take the effort you know, to understand actually how quantum mechanics works, I think they would say, hey, we're missing something here.